I like loot crate and I cannot lie. You other but the can't deny when a girl walks in. Oh, just kidding. Yeah, well, I like I do like loot crate. Damn, I do like that song too. So, y'all know I just be serious. I just be for real. <laughs> no, <laughs> what's up, guys? Your boy DeAnthony. Coming from Break Room Blitz, baby. Coming back at you with another unboxing. So, I'm new with this unboxing, guys. This is my first Loot Crate DX. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> my first Loot. <laughs> first Loot Crate right here. Loot Crate DX just came. a little late. Something happened. They dropped it off at the wrong place, y'all. I'm like, where's my Loot Crate DX, yo? They said it was delivered. Where is that? Somehow they delivered it downstairs to some other place. I'm like, yo, it got the address on it. And the cold part is, I got some other stuff that day. So I'm like, S what's going on? But here I am, a little late, but this is my version of the unboxing. Because don't nobody do it like me. Don't nobody do it like me. Ha! Don't nobody do it like, do it like, do it like. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> All right, let's get right into it. Y'all know, why do I, I know I do unboxings, but I don't never, I put my keys down somewhere over there on the table. What's going on here? All right, I'll be back. I ain't even gonna cut this part out. I do be getting my keys. All right, let's check this out. Man, I've had this at, at work all day, and I've been just like, like, can I leave early? Because I want to open up my Loot Crate box, yo. It's my first one. This is January's Loot Crate DX. What does DX stand for? What does that stand for? You guys know anybody know? The Extreme. Uh, what could else could it stand for? Deliciously Exciting. Oh, no. Exciting is what E is, isn't it? Don't know what DX stands for, but if you guys know, leave a comment. Let me know. Alright, so if you get your DX box, baby, this is what you're gonna see. Boo! Oh wow, I like that right there. That box looks nice. What? Transformers, robots in disguise. Do we need another Transformer movie? I don't think so, but Michael Bay does, so here we go. Uh alright, alright, alright. So we can just jump into the first thing, I guess. Uh, we got some action figures, looks like, Origins, looks like, um, from the, what, 1960 Batman show? I never liked that show. It was really goofy to me. Um, I was like, this is Batman? Okay, I guess. But then, they came out with that first Batman movie. I'm just opening these. I feel like this is not really going to be worth a lot, so let's just open them. Uh, let's see what's going on. Now they're in this thing here. And I gotta open them again. I opened them out the box, now I gotta open them out the package. Actually, I'm not gonna open them. This is what they are. They look like this, guys. So if you wanted to see, there they are. They're cool, I guess. Alright, so we got some Origins. That's the theme. January 2017, Loot Crate DX. So, all right. It's not really my favorite thing because I didn't really like the show. So, but that's just me. Go ahead and put that there. But I am liking this Transformers, though. Uh, let's see here. Oh, we got an Action Comics number one. Uh, metal. Hmm. I don't know what this is called, actually. It's a metal picture, metal poster. I don't know, but that's kind of cool, though. Some paraphernalia. And the uh, the regular Loot Crate, uh, we got the actual reprint of the comic, so that was really cool. Uh, but uh, this is cool, though. I think this. I think the comic should have been in this one, but that's, I, that's just me. I would have rather liked this one in the regular Loot Crate, and then in the more expensive DX... Give me the actual reprint of the comic book. But that's that's just me. Alright, so we got another book here. Looks like uh Art of Atari. Alright. 
um, capsule edition. I don't know what capsule edition mean, but uh, let's, take, let's take a look. Won't you be my neighbor? Uh, looks just like some, uh, I don't know, some, some Atari stuff. So if you're a game gamer, it... <laughs> So if you're a gamer historian, I guess this book might be interesting to you. Uh, yeah, so Art of Atari Capsule Edition. That's not all, folks. That is not all. Boom! We got another old school Detective Comics number 27. Starting this issue, the amazing... Unique Adventures of the Batman. Huh. I wonder if this is like the Batman's first edition here. 1939. That man old and mug, y'all. He should be dead and gone. But anyway, Bruce still lives on in our hearts. In our hearts. I'm making a heart right now, but I don't have my other hand. But that's, a, that's the heart. You know. Yeah. That's cool. I can hang this up on my wall, I guess. Got some metal, metal plates, metal, this is metal too, guys. I don't know what you call that, but, uh, yeah. And then we got our badge. There we go, you guys can see that, right? Um, is, is, the, the theme is Origins. <laughs> it's funny, I actually don't like the Origins of a lot of, these superhero characters, I like the progression or the evolution of the characters. I don't really like them when they first started. Like, like Superman, you can't fly? What? What? What's going on there? Now, Batman, this is so... There it is. It's cool, I guess. I actually like collecting these things. I have a bunch of them now. Well, like six. I'm not a bunch of them, but I just started. But you know what I'm saying. All right, so let's get to the card. Oh, I almost forgot the shirt. Like, I don't... The shirt is the most exciting thing that is in the thing for me. Um, so I don't know how you almost forgetting these. All right, so then we got a shirt. Boom. Oh, a long sleeve shirt. That's what I'm talking about. So, we got Transformers, Robots in Disguise. That's me transforming. I probably don't really sound like the real thing, but I just feel like that's how it would go. But that's kind of cool, though. 1984? Is that when they came out? I don't, I don't even know. You know what? I did not like the show until Beast, Beast Wars came out. Beast Wars was my That was my show. Transformers was cool, but Beast Wars, that was that's where they got me. I was like, oh, snap. Beast Wars, yo. I guess I wasn't really in the cars when I was a kid. No one cares about this story. Let's get on to the box, I guess, huh? Alright. <laughs> uh, this is a nice card, though. It's like, nominees are. <laughs> um, let's see. So, those things are called... Oh, just metal signs. So we had some exclusive Superman, Batman metal signs. Uh, we had an exclusive Atari book, um, but I, I I guarantee I could probably go online and, and get that. But they say it's exclusive. Hey, 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 hey. And then we had some 1960 Batman bendable figures. I guess. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do with those actually. Um, yeah, I don't. I don't. I really don't know if that was a good item for this. For me personally, it wasn't a good item, but that's just me. Yeah, then we have our Optimus Prime schematic shirt and our pin. All right, so let's just run down real quick. So we got the shirt. It's a long sleeve shirt, guys. So I'm going to give it $12 versus $10 because it's more material. Um, that book, I'm also going to give $12. Let's see if they have a price on it. They have prices on the back of them. No. But I'm going to give 12 bucks, so that's $24. I'm going to give this $10. Now, you might be able to give it more, but it wasn't exclusive. And um, I feel like 
these are just toys for kids. They're not to me. They're not collectibles, but that's just me in my mind. Sorry, guys. So we're at 34, and then I'm gonna give. I mean, the most that I would pay for these are five bucks, but then I guess they're exclusive and they're of, you know, the start, I guess, of these two. So, uh, I mean, I guess you can give them 10 bucks if you just wanted to. I have a price on these? Let's see. No. But you have to excuse me for my pricing. I don't buy these. It's my first time ever having them. When I went to the Anime Expo, they had some of these. Well, not like these specifically, but they had some metal signs um and they were selling them for about ten dollars i guess but they were more like you know artists that have done them they weren't like you know massively reprinted so i'm just gonna give i'm gonna give them i'll give it ten dollars i guess whatever so that's another 20 so what we got we got 24 24 34 54 uh, so that's 54 dollars guys and then if you want to say the pen is worth you know a dollar maybe you can do that but um, so that's 54 dollars out of this box um so I paid 44 dollars no yeah I paid 44 dollars for this box um, I'm not really sure I paid 44 dollars I don't want it to be worth 54 um, it wasn't really that exciting you know, I was hoping that they would give me something really good. You know, in the last one, they got a Ninja Turtle item in the um, original Loot Crate box. Uh, so I was hoping for, like, a bigger Ninja Turtle item. But, you know, they threw in some Batman. And me, this is my personal opinion. Me personally, too much Batman. But um, I did appreciate this, but I didn't really need these, guys. You know, I don't know what I'm going to do with those. But, um, yeah, I'm not really, really pleased too much. I mean, if I had to rate it, I would probably give it three out of five stars if I had to rate the box. But that's just me personally. I'm not attached to any of these things. I'm not excited about any of these things. For me, maybe you guys were. And this right here is like dope. And, you know, you guys are going to hang this on your wall or on your mantle or... You know, let your kids play with it or whatever. But I'm not attached to it for the price anyway. This is a monthly box. So it also, if you guys want to get your own, check out the link in the in the description. Um, it will be discounted. But uh, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm not. You guys tell me. Is this too much Batman? Or would you guys rather see a Ninja Turtle item in there from like the 1980 80s series? You know, that's me personally. That, that's what I grew up on. On 1984, Ninja Turtles all day, I was a uh, Donatello fan. So, but that's just me. All right, guys, I'm your boy, DeAnthony. Let me get up out of here. And thanks for uh, checking me out. I know I'm new to the unboxing, so I appreciate you guys, all the people who like and subscribe, and even comment. You know, I do like to have those conversations. So if there's something you guys, you know, want to say, good or bad, go ahead and put it in the comments, and we can have a discussion. Hi right, guys, I'm your boy DeAnthony. Oh, check out some of our other stuff, guys, on our page. Take a look. Take a look at it now. I don't know what that's from, but take a look at our page. Check out our other stuff, guys. All right, I'm your boy DeAnthony. I'm out. Peace. I like loot crate and I cannot lie. You other but the can't deny. When a just kidding. Y'all know I just be playing. Y'all.